It really begins with the art teachers, and we get them the information about this contest in the summer. The art teachers have a meeting in June, so they find out about this, and it really, starting at the beginning of the school year in August, they just uh, put the students to work, and it's by grade level. So we have K through two, and then it's um, a third through fifth grade, sixth through eighth grade, and then high schoolers. We had two-dimensional and three-dimensional art. With the sculptures, they did everything from, we had clay pieces submitted, using different just materials to form and make their art. And then with the uh, two-dimensional art, we had everything from watercolor, pencil drawing, charcoals, actual paintings like acrylics, um, just a wide variety of media. Um, I used acrylic paint and I painted it on and I like horses and I ride them and I've been to the steeplechase before so that's what inspired to paint something like that. I've got the people in the background and the riders on their horses racing. I got second place. That's pretty good. How you made it? Is it 3D piece? Yeah, I just made it out of um, poster board, black poster board, and shards of mirror, pretty much. Also dowels, so the front legs are actually poseable. I've got some wire and copper piping in the back um, with some gears attached to it. Um, How long did it take to put together? It took about three weeks. Three weeks? Yeah. Well, that's really good. Um, this is just my second time doing a steeplechase, and I don't know, the idea of this just came to me, of just in joining watercolor and color pencil together to make such a cohesive piece. And it took me about, I would say, six or seven hours to completely make it. Did you do it all in one sitting? Oh, no. <laughs> we were very surprised. It was The judges said they were just amazed at the talent, at the level of uh, just knowledge about art and, um, and the depth of just the wide variety of art that really was submitted. Yeah, the to our businesses and a lot of correspondence for different things. We love to show off the children's art, whether it's a notepad, we have note cards that we send off. First I traced it and then I watercolored it and then I drew the gate and then I drew the ears and added the stripes in the hair. How does it feel having your picture on the stationery? Good. We, we had a lot of proud faces tonight. We really saw that the children love, you know, they want to be recognized and, uh, and they worked hard and they deserve it. So they were re very, very excited to get their prizes. And not only that though, just to really have their art displayed. For some of them, it's the first time that they've really had their art displayed in public. And have you ever done a horse before? No, this is actually my first time. Are you, you like art though? Yeah, it's pretty fun so far. All right, are you gonna go to Steeplechase? Yes. Good. Look forward to seeing you there. This drawing almost looks like it's a bionic, like metal uh, <laughs> robot. What's up with that? I guess it does. <laughs> it's like a horse from the future, right? Yes, it's exactly what it is. You know, Steeplechase, did you get invited this year? I might go. I'm, I probably will go actually now that my horse has been entered in the competition for the steeplechase, so. You're on the Jumbotron, huh? Mm -hmm. Why don't you wave to yourself on the Jumbotron right now? Hi. <laughs> good, that was a good